What's up guys, welcome back to my channel, daily vlog number 6. Let me know how you guys are liking the daily vlogs, um, I really want to see... Let me know how you guys are liking the daily vlogs, I've gotten a lot of comments so far saying that they're enjoyable or that they like the topics that I'm talking about, so comment down below, let me know what you guys are thinking, but without further ado, let's get into the vlog. Listen guys, I know. First step of addiction is uh, acceptance, and I'm accepting that I have one. I know there's a problem. Alright y'all, so we just got finished filming a video for my main channel, for my normal Sunday video channels. Um, Jerry came through and helped me out filming it. We yeah. just ate a bunch of foods. Um, that was good. Yeah, some of them were good, some of them were not so good. Yeah. Um, but that video is going to be out in a, not for a while, to be honest. Um, but make sure to keep an eye out for it. Alright guys, I loaded my bike up into the trunk of my car. I'm about to go try and ride my bike on this trail. There's a lot of people here though. I don't really like going places with a lot of people. And then like filming in public too is also like kind of like a, a scary thing for me. So we'll see how this goes. I also lost my AirPods, so I'm pretty peeved about that. They've been lost for like a week now. I have absolutely no idea where they are. Guess I'm just gonna have to ride my bike in silence. Trying to go, hit yeah, a party, jumping off. Hey, we putting on a show, trying to catch a vibe. We do this every time, like, na 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 na. Feeling like I'm on the highway, cause everything been going my way. And now they looking at me sideways. I'm like, na 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 na. This is where I want to be, na na na. Never ever gonna leave. My bike ride's complete. I did it, guys. Second bike ride I did every other day. So yesterday I did skateboarding, today I did bike riding. Monday I'll be back out here again riding my bike. Um, I did a lot better this time, I think. It was like a flat, even ground in comparison to like where I live. It's all like up and then down and up and down. Those suck and I hate it. So bike ride complete. Let's get home. Camera battery's about to die. Let's get it. So for today's subject, I want to talk about something that's probably like my favorite subject to talk about. And that is the concept of mind over matter. So I feel like everybody by now has probably heard about mind over matter, but the basic like synopsis of it is that it's like the mind literally controlling your body. And I've got such a strong belief in that. Now obviously it's not anything crazy where it's like, oh, if you break your arm, mind over matter and your arm's not broken, because I get made fun of all the time for things like that. But it's more like, oh, I'm feeling sick, but all of a sudden my mind is like controlling my body and I'm feeling a little bit better now. Kind of like a placebo effect, but different. Now, those of you guys who know me lo know that I love listening to music. I'm always listening to some sort of song or something, and I my favorite types of songs are the ones where the lyrics mean something more to me. It's not just like songs, like the lyrics touch me in a way. So some of my favorite songs that I've talked about, like the mind controlling body, is NF, The Search. Um, in that song he says, um, the mind is a powerful place, and what you feed it can affect it in a powerful way. Which is like crazy to me, and it's one of my favorite lines that I've ever heard in a song, because it's literally so true, and it goes along with everything that I believe in. The mind is literally this crazy powerful thing, and it's like, whatever like you tell your mind will affect you in either like a negative or a positive way. 
which is why like lo like self love is which is why like self love is so important. Another song that I really like that talks about the mind controlling the body and stuff is actually by Logic. It's called Anxiety, and in it he's like having like anxiety attacks, and he has no idea what it's from. And he's going to the doctors, and he's trying to figure out what it, what's happening to him. And the doctor tells him it's anxiety, and he's like, no, there's there's no way. He's like, there's no way that these physical things that I'm feeling are anxiety. And in his song, he actually says, um, he says it can't be anxiety, and can't or or can it? Can it literally be the mind controlling the body? Yes, of course it can. I'm so in control of my mind and my body. Which just goes right along with everything that I believe in when it comes to mind over matter. Like, your your mind literally controls your body sometimes. And it's been proven in things with, obviously, like, anxiety and, like, mental health issues. It's been proven that the power of your mind is so crazy. It can literally control how you feel and your physical effects. Now, the only reason I get, like, made fun of for the whole mind over matter thing is because I talk about it way too much. And I apply it to literally everything inside my life. But that's just how passionate I am about it. Like, I, I truly do believe that the mind is such a powerful place that it can literally control things that go on within your life. Both your physical both your physical effects of your life and just, like, your, your outcome. I feel like if you have a great outcome and a great look on things, then life's going to treat you a lot better. Yeah, and, uh, I don't know, guys. That's just my view on the whole mind over matter thing. Um, it was a really short point of view, um, but I feel like everybody knows mind over matter. I don't really have to explain it that much. It's a, a very talked about subject. Everybody's got tattoos of it. It's just really talked about. Everyone knows about it. So, um, yeah, that's just one of my like my most passionate things that I live by. Uh, my most passionate um, points of view, I guess, on Earth. <sighs> my most passionate sort of like point of view when it comes to like living. Um, so, yeah, I just wanted to share that with you guys for today's topic. If you have another topic you want to hear me talk about, comment down below so I can get to it. Yeah, I don't know, it's just something like really intriguing that I find about the, all that. And it's like, it's, there's physical like proof that it does work because it's like you, you look at like people with, uh, with cancer and it's like those who've had like poor attitudes or whatever, their, their condition worsens. But those who have like good attitudes and good outlooks on it, their condition gets better. So having like a positive outlook on everything and, and using your mind to control the outlook or, and using your mind to like control the, um, the end game and using your mind to kind of control things does actually work. Like it's, it's proven. Look at how many different tumblers and <laughs> beverage holder cup things that we have. It's a ridiculous amount, and she, my mom, my mom refuses to get rid of any of them. <laughs> Hoarders, oh, we need help. All right, guys, we got our uh, ice cream and brownies. We got our FaceTime all set up. Uh, we got a bottle and a chaser. All right, hello everybody. <laughs> welcome, <laughs> welcome to Girls Night In Corona Edition. It's, it's good to have you all here. Hi, Tasha. Alcoholic and edition. Nick. <laughs> Al <laughs> Girls Night In Alcoholic. drinking edition, uh, Corona edition. I got my stuff ready, y'all. I'm ready for this. Oh, shoot. Time. <laughs> Alright, guys, so that's going to be the end of this daily vlog. Thank you so much for watching. If you like the video, go ahead and like down below. It really helps me out. Subscribe to my channel to see more content. Um, tomorrow, you guys are going to have a normal video from me, guys, from me since it is Sunday, my normal day of uploading. So stay tuned for that. Stick around. It'll be up at 11 a.m. Um, and then Monday we'll be back, and then Monday we'll be right back with these daily vlogs. But thank you guys so much for watching. I appreciate it. Um, and I'll see you guys on Monday. Peace.